My name is Marcia Vargas. I have been a humanitarian worker for almost 20 years now, back in Colombia and in um, Africa, generally Latin America, in conflict and natural disaster situations. I have been really in the field and in headquarters. When I started as a humanitarian worker, I was really young and I had really experienced people around me. They learned doing. So when I arrived, they said to me, like, uh, you have to do like this and that, that and that, no explanation, just go to the field. And I said, okay. When you are in the field and you have to, impro to improvise a, a negotiation, you don't really know how to manage things or who to talk to, you are not really prepared for. It can make things very difficult for you, for the community, for the group, for everyone. But now that there is, you have kind of a structure, you, you really can follow step by step. So that helps a lot and really it can, it can really save time and lives, which is the most important thing. As a facilitator, it's a complete and new uh, experience for me because I'm learning from the others. They are giving me knowledge and I'm gathering all this information in my head and then we are producing new things for the others. I really think that it teaches you a lot of things and that opens your mind because you think, oh, this is happening just here and this is just my problem. Then you go to another context and you listen to the others and you realize that, oh no, that is not the case. I have the same situation just in another language, so and with another culture. So you really are learning about the, the others, from the others. For us as humanitarians, we are in the field in really far away places uh, where you cannot communicate very easily with the external world. If you are in a situation where you can have internet and you can just send an email into the community saying, I have this situation, what do you suggest I can do? that connects you with the world, with the people, and can open your mind to a new uh, solution for the situation you are living.